do you ever wonder why do people make such a big deal out of a Bible being edge lined and leather lined? What does it matter? Why in the world is it such a big deal? And why are they so expensive? I'm about to show you why right now. Thanks for joining me here. I've got a Bible here. This Bible is actually a really special Bible to me. This Bible was given to me by my wife's grandfather. He pastored and ministered for over 50 years. Then he retired and he actually just recently gave me this Bible as a gift. As I looked through it, I noticed some really awesome things that really stood out to me. That this Bible's 50 or 60 years old, it's still in really good condition and there's a few reasons why so let's look at them really quickly as you can see right here that uh, when i open this bible up it is leather lined it says leather lined right here and uh silk sewn and also you can see that small little quarter inch tab that's added to the block on the front and back of the book block and that is the edge lined tab. This liner is leather and it's held up really well over time, 60 years of use by a pastor. So that shows you the longevity that's added when you have a Bible that is leather lined and edge lined. When we look through this Bible, you can see that the, the paper is in pretty good condition in some places, but then again, there are some places where it's really torn and uh, it's been really used extensively. I love every bit of it. I'm not gonna rebind this. I'm gonna keep it just like it is because I love it. And you can see where the sewing held this together. This is why you want a sewn binding. In other bindings, this would have fallen apart. This would have fallen to pieces. But this section is held together because it's sewn. And you also have that edge line tab and the leather lining is still in really great condition. If you think about the analogy, the outer cover is just the skin. Then you have the liners, really the muscle, the strength, the strength of the binding comes from the liner. Uh, so no matter how nice the cover is, if the liner is synthetic or paper or something really flimsy, it's not gonna last. And then finally, the, uh, the skeleton of the book itself is the sewn signature construction. And then when you combine the, uh, the edge line construction with the leather liner, that's really the muscle that keeps it strong. And then the outer cover protects all of that from the elements. So here's just a really quick look at a Bible that's 60 years old, still going strong. And it's really well worn. I love this Bible. I love to read from this Bible. It means so much to me. Even the, the, the ribbon is just beaten, all gone. And I love it just like that. But it just points to the purpose of premium construction techniques and why we pay what we pay for premium Bibles because they're gonna last 60 years, not six. Or six months. So it is a quick video, but if you're wondering why premium Bibles cost so much, that's why. This in, in its day would be considered a premium Bible. Absolutely it would be. I'm so thankful to have it. I wanted to share that with you guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe and also click the notification bell so you can be notified when I upload new videos. As always, God bless.